Well, UNL dorms Cather and Pound are set for demolition in just two weeks, and some students are turning this construction project into important research. Channel 8 Eyewitness News reporter Bailey Bischoff has the story for us. Structural engineering students at UNL are taking their education out of the classroom and into a demolition site. In our Department of Civil Engineering, we have this rare opportunity to use this demolition site to understand how loads are redistributed uh, during extreme events. They're studying the Cather Pound Halls, slated to be destroyed on December 22nd. The data they collect will educate engineers on how to design buildings that can withstand forces, like earthquakes, winds, and blasts. Our goal is to make structure safer as well as to mitigate hazards. The team of seven students, along with research professors, have placed sensors throughout the two towers. They pick up on how the building moves as the demolition process begins. This data allows them to learn about what it takes to build a strong building. Students, as well as the engineering design community, uh, have to make multiple assumptions when we're designing buildings. Um, and really what it comes down to is how much do our structures move, you know, what are the force components that we have to resist. They'll also collect data during the blast. We learn about how structures go down. It's very useful for us to interpret about what requires uh, to build a safer structure. In a much more realistic way than could ever be taught in a classroom. It's a pretty great research opportunity. In Lincoln, Bailey Bischoff, Channel 8 Eyewitness News.